Do you know what processor is in your computer? What motherboard? What graphics card? How much memory? Very few computer users know all of this or can remember it. You may need this information when you are experiencing problems and need technical support or when you consider upgrading your computer or when you need to rebuild your system onto new hardware. In this guide I will introduce you to Speccy, a Windows software application that enables you to find all this information and record it for future use. I will also show you a method to get a list of all the software installed on your computer. At the end of the video I will show you the alternatives available for Apple Mac systems. In your internet web browser, go to the CCleaner website. Click on the drop down menu for home users and select Speccy. Click on the green download free version button and again on download on the following page. Select the download location when prompted to do so. The download file is less than 8 MB in size and will be downloaded in seconds. Click on the name of the download file in the bottom left of your browser window and confirm the installation. This process was recorded from a Google Chrome browser. If you use Firefox or any other browser, it may appear differently. After the installation, the program opens and you are ready to get going. Once installed, you can also find Speccy from the Windows Start button in the bottom left. Scroll down the list of alphabetical names to Speccy. Speccy has a very clean user interface and a simple menu. Down the left hand side are the different view options. If you don't see this, click on view and ensure that show navigation menu is selected. The default view summary provides a concise view of the operating system and the different hardware components. When you select a specific view, much more information about that component is displayed. A very useful feature of Speccy is the snapshot. Snapshot gathers all the information from your computer and write it to a special Speccy format file. This snapshot file can only be opened with Speccy. The idea is that you send a snapshot of your computer to someone else who can read it with Speccy on their computer. The snapshot file is very small, typically less than 30 kilobytes. Once you have saved the snapshot, you can attach it to an email and send it to your technical support person. Irrespective of the view, Snapshot always saves all the information, not just the currently selected views information. You can also save the system's information in a text file that can be read with Notepad or similar text editor. The text file is larger, typically 150 kilobytes, but still small enough to be sent by email.
Specky only provides information about your computer's hardware and operating system. To get a list of all the other software installed on your computer, I can refer you to this website. It provides two different methods to get such a list. Firstly, with a command inside the built-in Windows PowerShell system. I use this command. And here is the resulting text file. The website provides a second clever method with CCleaner, a utility program that can be downloaded and used for free. CCleaner was also developed by the British firm Periform, who developed Specky. This is the result after the text file generated by CCleaner was imported into an Excel spreadsheet. This information may be crucial if you need to rebuild your computer system from scratch. I recommend that you save this information at least once a year and keep backups of it. Specky is not available for Apple Mac, but there are a few alternatives that runs on Mac OS with similar functionality. Visit this website. The best Mac alternative is NewFetch, which is both free and open source. All the links used in this video are listed in the description below.